Our uh, next guest is uh, one of the stars of the popular television series, Ed, as well as one of the stars of the film Jeepers Creepers, which is in theaters currently. Here is Justin Long, everybody. Thank you for being here. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Congratulations for on your uh, you're beginning your second series, second season of the series, Ed. Oh, thank you, you must sir. Be pretty excited, proud. Very, of very excited. Well, nice yeah. to see things are going so well for you. Things are things are going good. You were supposed to be here last week, and and or it was a couple of weeks ago, and we yeah. were talking. To, uh, Hillary Clinton was here, right? That's right. And we we just ran out of time, and so you came back. I, I hope that didn't unsettle you. Are no, you all right? no. In fact, in fact, uh, I was kind of flattered to get by, get bumped by uh, Hillary Clinton. Well, it was a big it big was, night, really. Yeah, it was. Yeah. 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 <laughs> It would have been kind of strange. It would have been a tough act to follow. You know, it would have been like, you know, Carrot Top going on after Mahatma Gandhi or something. <laughs> so, you know, I got, I got kind of lucky. <laughs> but uh, I've been, I've been, uh, yeah, I feel, I feel like the brown lemur, actually. I feel, yeah. I feel like he was acting very anxious. Stay out of my lap. Yeah. <laughs> So, so you, you, you've been unnerved by the experience of waiting a couple of weeks? I've just, I, I get uh, anxiety dreams. Oh, really? I, uh, you know, as an actor, I, I us they're usually involved forgetting lines or, you know, being on stage naked and uh, <laughs> some, I, I'm okay there, I suppose. But, but, uh, <laughs> but uh, I've been, I've been, yeah, I've been getting these dreams that I've been on your show and, and uh, you'll say, you'll like, you know, you'll start asking questions, you, you'll say like, so I, I heard you, uh, you took a cross-country trip and mm -hmm. I'll, I'll be like falsely modest with the audience, try to fish for you know applause. I'll be like, ah, oh, the, the audience doesn't want to hear about right. my trip, but they but they won't applaud. You know, they won't clap. So <laughs> <laughs> they really don't want. Yeah, to they don't want to hear it. Yeah, that's tough. So the whole thing goes on like that. Just just silence. Now, so. did you, now you mentioned the dream. You're telling a story about a cross country trip. Did you, did you actually have a story about a cross country trip? I did. Uh, I did. I. I... <laughs> they don't want to hear that. No. Um. I have many stories. I, I, uh... <laughs> Let's just take them one at a time. Yeah, all right? yeah. Um, no, I. I uh, we actually got pulled over. We were we were video. Well, cross country. You're leaving from is California coming east? east uh, yeah, we. West? Well, I, I flew out uh, to, to to L.A. Uh -huh. and uh, I I just drove. We drove in a. Um, I actually when I when I came out here when I when I moved out to New York I had to get my car shipped across the country. Mm -hmm. I had one of those little little Miatas little. Kind of fruity, but but it was fun to drive. You know, sorry, kind of, kind of what? Kind of, you know, it was kind of. What, what kind of Miata was? Oh, the it, Miata. Yeah, the Miata. The, the, the yeah. little roadster. Yeah. <laughs> what did I say? Yeah, though no, they're cute. You're right. I'm yeah, just, yeah. I'm just, I'm just, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! Wow. Um, and 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 I so I hired one of those you know shipping companies. They put them on the flatbed truck. Oh yeah. And it's kind of it was like a thousand dollars to get it shipped all the way out. But uh, when I moved back to do it, I had to, I needed a car out here, so. Uh, so I, they said allow seven to ten days for delivery, and I waited about two weeks, and I started calling the company, and, and uh, I finally got somebody on the phone, and, and there was this kind of slow-speaking southern fellow, and he, he was like, uh, Mr. Long, are you sitting down? <laughs> and and I, I said, oh, oh boy, why, why, what, what happened? He said, well, uh, it, it's a funny story. Well, it's not, it's not funny, but it's one of them things you're going to look back at and laugh. You know what I mean? <laughs> And uh, it turns out your, your, your car was on a flatbed truck and it got stuck on a train track in Inman, South Carolina. And the train just came right on through and... Is that right? Yeah, and, and oh, uh, goodness. smashed your car to smithereens, I think is what he said. <laughs> and, uh, and so I tried to... And they were charging me for storing the, the little wreck. And, <laughs> like, the remainder of the car? Yeah, yeah. Train? You know, Miata is small to begin with, but, but after hit by a train, it was... Not a lot left, and, and so I called up the storage place, and I said, I said, look, first of all, take my car out of storage, you know, and, and uh, if you could go in the, in the glove compartment, my roommates put all my papers, I needed to prove ownership of the car to collect on the insurance, right. and I said, you know, if you could find any, salvage any papers from the car, and he said, well, well, that's going to be hard to do. It was the same guy who worked at the storage <laughs> place, apparently. It's my only southern... <laughs> it's fine. It's all purpose. It's yeah. fine, sure. He said... Uh, um, he said, well, it's going to be hard to do. Uh, see, last night some young hooligans broke into the compound and set your car afire. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so there's nothing left. And I said, so I'm paying for a pretty much like an ashen kind of little <laughs> smashed car. Uh -huh. And they were still making me, I tried to collect back the deposit. I paid $250 deposit. And, 
And I said, can I at least get that back? And, the, and they said, uh, no. And I said, so I paid $250 <laughs> for you to destroy my brand new car. And he said, well, no, no, you, you paid for us to ship it. <laughs> 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 Didn't really, sarcasm wasn't really yeah, in there. The destroying was free. Yeah, 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 that's, that's, uh, yeah, that was a benefit. Oh, they're not going to charge you for that. <laughs> yeah, Heck no. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's a pretty good story. Yeah, so, I guess, I guess I am laughing about it now. Yeah. You like working on Ed? I love it. You get along well with everybody over there? I love everyone except that Tom Cavanaugh. Who, uh, kinda, <laughs> well, kind of hard to work with. He's a little, little prima donna. Jeez, I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> no, he's the best. Yeah, yeah. He's the best, the nicest guy in the world. Well, good. I'm glad you could come back. Oh, thank you. Nice thank you for having you. me, thank sir. Thank you for being it's here. It's an honor to be here. Well, it's an honor to have you. Justin Long, everybody. Thank you. We'll be right back with Daniel Rodriguez and God Bless America.